Hello everyone, welcome back to Developers and Coders Club of NIT Gartala. Today we are going to discuss code forces around 878's problem statement C, which is Sky Resort. So in this question, we have a person, Dima Vatrushin, who want to go on vacation and he have few conditions. So the first condition is if he will go, then at least k days he want to go on vacation or means if he, uh, he want to go at somewhere then he will spend at least k days and the second condition is uh, that uh, the minimum temperature and the maximum temperature should not cross the given temperature which will be given us in the question so now let's see what is the question is so let's directly come to the example so here we can see in this example we have an array of length 6 which is this one and this is the one which tells us how many minimum consecutive day he wanna spend and this is 3 which tells us the temperature above which he can't spend outside or on vacation so on 0th day means uh, on that first day where uh, temperature is 0 he can go for vacation on second day also he can go because it's equal to 3 on third day also he can go but on 5 he can't go because it's above 3 on 5th day he can go outside on 6th day also so now we can see these are 3 consecutive numbers on which he can go on vacation so here 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5 there are total 5 days on which he can go on vacation but answer says it's 9 how? so the thing is in the question it's written that he can spend at least so he can also spend 2 days he can also spend 3 days and from here also he can spend either 1 day or 2 day and from here also so it will be basically if he spend from if we consider this then uh, from here he can spend 1 day he can spend 2 day he can spend 3 day and similarly from here he can spend 1 day he can spend 2 day similarly from here so what will we do whatever uh, if we find this number means uh, we will count the continuous uh, elements which are smaller than or equal to this number means the minimum temperature maximum temperature and uh, if when we will find this then uh, we will count the total numbers and we will subtract the k from it and uh, okay uh, let's directly see the code I guess it will be more better so in this question you can see uh, here we are taking input n k and q array of size n and then we are taking input of array then what we are doing here is uh, basically we are running a for loop in this for each element if it is greater than q then obviously uh, uh, it's not favorable because the it's above the minimum maximum temperature so we will continue and if uh, we find the temperature which is below or below or equal to our favorable temperature then uh, we will run a while loop and we will count the total number of consecutive days which are favorable and then we will subtract if it's above the minimum days means uh, whatever is the our consecutive day which are minimum which, on which he can go for vacation we will subtract that number and we will add 1 and then what will we do we will apply simple formula of n and plus uh, 1 by 2 why we did that uh, we saw that question uh, like in this example that uh, this this and this this and this these five were favorable so this was the these three numbers were favorable so this make this can make three type of pair like this and this can make two like this and this can make one so if we will add it up so we will come up with a formula which is n and plus one by two it's just a simple basic observation so this was the code I guess you understood. So thank you for watching.